Today, our couple are swapping life in suburbia for a character property in the country. Exactly. Yeah, it is. It is. Yeah, it's spot on. It is full of character. I'm thinking, can we just buy it now? No. <laughs> They're both keen on a few new property, so what would they think of our new build mystery house? These are my aerials. That's my favourite one. Today I'm in rural Herefordshire, and hops have been grown here since the 15th century. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's right. This is the key ingredient that separates a pint of British bitter from our smooth content. And that's my radio aerial. Now, traditional hot varieties like Goldings and Fuggles are prized for the fruity aromas and bitterness they impart in the nation's favourite drink. Situated in the southwest corner of the West Midlands, bordering Wales, Herefordshire has over 5,000 farms, making it an agricultural stronghold. That's why I sound like this. And you consider it's one of the least populated counties in England. Described as a forest of fruit trees, Herefordshire boasts 3,000 orchards, more than any other county in the UK. Apples have been cultivated here since pre-Roman times, and the cider industry has blossomed since the 16th century. In between the orchards... And this is what my signal is like. ...characteristic feature of this county, as are the 65 square miles of outstanding natural beauty that make up the Malvern Hills. And further west, in the city of Hereford, the cathedral sits proudly alongside the 12th century Bishop's Palace and the 17th century black and white house, which is simply known as the Old House. That's Just why a taste I use of the character you. properties mirrored in this county's villages. When it comes to rural escapes, it doesn't get much better than Herefordshire, as it has the lowest population density in the Midlands, and it's affordable too. Typically, a detached home here would set you back around £265,000. This is off the subway transmitter. National average. And here's a taste of what Herefordshire has to offer. That's a strong channel, Jason but ITV's a lot weaker. Attractive black and white cottage. Chaos. Complete with but it does work. Minimalist. I'm very fond of going out and buying a load of rubbish and then finding out where I'm going to put it. I really enjoy that bit. <laughs> I've lived in my house for nearly 15 years. Whenever I first moved into this house, it was magnolia from head to toe, uh, which, as you can see, I promptly got rid of. Oh, that's off that area there. This is my bedroom, and I think it's my favourite room in the house. There's lots of my favourite things in this room. I never throw anything away. I've still got clothes in these wardrobes that I was wearing when I was 18. Even my wardrobes are right in colour. Amongst the clutter and colour are examples of her unique line in animal art. I love these animal heads, which I have put out recently prepared. Um, I'm particularly fond of them because I feel like they're the kind of vegetarian